I'm Rachel Serwitz, and I'm the founder and CEO of Woken, which is a career exploration and job search platform and coaching. I'm here to talk about typical MBA career paths versus forging your own unique path. So first I want to start out with why do people typically choose an MBA? Well, oftentimes it's either they're figuring out, you know, what they really want to do next and exploring their career direction, uh, or there's some obvious Paths, right? Whether it's the financials sector, the consulting sector, or just somebody's trying to figure out their next steps. And so, you know, I just want to encourage you that just because there are somewhat typical paths doesn't mean that you should or have to go do that. And so, you know, there's a lot of actual benefits to finding your own unique path. And studies show that when you enjoy what you're doing, you actually make more money doing it and make more money faster doing it. So we want to give you the encouragement to go figure out what you're meant to do, what your best strengths are. And, you know, there's always that joke that, you know, when you apply, you don't have to stick with whatever your essay was. So once you get to school. Um, it's a great opportunity at that point to pursue what I like to call career exploration. You can even do it before you begin school, after you get accepted, um, or, you know, once you begin your MBA journey. It's, you know, the sooner the better. Um, and that way, before the recruiting process, you really sort of know what the best fit is for you in terms of the role that you really want to pursue. And so I'm going to tell you very briefly how to uncover your ideal Path. So career exploration is a step-by-step -step process of learning and reflection to clarify which role and which industry and which environment would be the best fit for you. So it is a way of bridging the gap and figuring out what path might be right for you before you get there. And so this really entails a lot of reflection and a lot of learning so that you can really deeply understand what each path is and reflect on what that means for you. So that, again, means learning enough about each of those paths so that you can have an accurate understanding of what it might look and feel like to go pursue that journey and really be able to compare and contrast and prioritize and narrow in the best path forward for you. So just remember, if you still have options, it's important to keep learning and keep reflecting until you can confidently say that you know which direction would be the best fit for you.